What is going on guys? It's gonna give you some soon bats. Hun bats, not soon bats. Don't know what I was going for there. He's kinda of mixing Sun Wukong uh with Hun Bats. Um Hun Bats the uh, I guess you could say newest god in addition to Smite today. Uh however it's really just a remake uh a makeover of uh Sun Wukong. Uh basically they've changed Sun Wukong to Hun Bats. Um the Mayan god. Uh, really, really interesting. They changed up his kit just a little bit. All of his skill shots remain the same. Uh, there are a couple different tweaks on each one. Um, but, uh, let's see. So my Ymir didn't load in. There he is. Yeah, I get the jungle. Alright, cool. So I'm going to go ahead and get my jungle set up a flow in. Um, don't juggle too often, but uh, it is a lot of fun. I will admit. I think I want to hand to the gods. Tink, I want Hand of the Gods. Let's get to one of that. And then, um... Some of these. Alright. Should be giving me some good, uh, ganking potential as well. Um... We have... This is must be the mid laner. If we can grab that, red buff would be fantastic. Red buff would be fantastic. Okay, it looks like we're going for blue. That's okay. Anyway, he's gonna go over his passive and ability. His passive is called Infuse Strikes. Um, this is changed from Sun Wukong's original passive. Basically what this does is when you use an ability, um, your next auto attack will do 20% uh, physical damage um, increase on that. Okay, so you gotta tank it up for me. That's fine. Oh, okay. Let's see how it is. I'm gonna go ahead and grab these uh, little things. She should have let me have the buff. That's okay. Um, but anyways, bam! Give me that smack down. Uh, so this is a passive ability. Is basically when I use an ability, my next auto attack uh, will be um, will do additional uh, physical damage. Uh, pretty good uh, damage. So I mean, it's kind of like a polynomicon essentially, uh, except this is passive. Um, so you kind of just have that stat, uh, just like right down. I have my hog, so I should be good uh, to clear this red pretty easily. Boop -ba -doop -ba -doop. Let's go ahead and pick up Summer Soul. Uh, but anyways, that is my passive ability. Uh, my passive ability, first ability is called Somersault. Uh, also something that isn't really included in his passive, uh, but I think I should mention now uh, right away, is as you can see, um, kind of my auto attacks are in a uh, sort of a... Woo, that was close. That was really close. Holy cow. <laughs> can you tell that I have not um, jungled before? Uh, but anyways, um, so his auto attacks are a four thing combo. Uh, it's a little bit slower, uh, so you hit one, two, three, and then like your third and your fourth auto attack are really, really quick, really fast paced. I'm gonna get owned too hard here. Looks like it should be good to go. I'm gonna just go ahead and back. Your right tower is under attack. Our right tower. We already getting pushed in. All right, so let's grab Tabby. I love, oh, I love these new items. So exciting. Such a big patch. Uh, but anyway, so uh, that's my passive ability. First ability is called Somersault. Uh, it is a circle ground target ability. You leap to the ground target location, doing physical damage and s applying a slow to anybody in that area. Uh, the same as Sun Wukong's one. Um, I don't think they changed it around really at all. Uh, no, they did not. Um, but that's his first ability. Uh, second ability is called, you just saw it right there, it's a cone ability out in front of you. Uh, it's a physical, does physical burst damage to anybody in that area. Quite a bit of physical damage as well. It, it just does that physical damage burst. Um, I don't think they changed it up to give anything else. Uh, let's check real quick. No, it just does a damage, uh, so burst damage. It also kind of has a delay, as you can see. I have to like wind up for it uh, a little bit, and then I'll smash down. Um, also, something about the fourth hit, as you see here from my auto attacks, is the fourth one is AoE, does AoE uh, to anybody in the area in front of you. Um, my Apollo, or I guess the Ymir still hasn't, still hasn't quite come up yet. Hunmats. Good stuff. Kind of dropped some FPS lag during that fight, or had some FPS lag during that fight, uh, but good engagement overall. Really good gank by my Athena. Uh, 
whose lane is not covered. That kind of sucks that our Ymir is AFK. Um, uh, anyways, I think I'm going to get an Aegis, maybe. Du -du 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 -du. Yes, definitely going to get an Aegis. Uh, go ahead and invest in that now. Um, I have some good uh, mana potions, so I'll just keep those. Just keep what I have. Um, but anyways, that's my second ability, does that damage, uh, the third ability is called Sacred Monkey, you shoot a, uh, monkey out, uh, forward, what it will do is it will arc two different, uh, enemies, uh, so what I mean by arc is it will, like, fly, hit, if it hits a target, then it'll bounce to the next closest target, as you can see right there, um, by what it just did. Uh, it can only hit one target once, so it won't bounce back and forth between two targets like it used to do. It used to do that. Um, but uh, now it does not, so they changed that a little bit. However, if it lands, if the last hit of your monkey, uh, be that if, if it's um, just if if that is the last final hit that your third ability hits uh, is on an enemy god, you will instantly teleport to that enemy. Um, just teleport right in front of them. Such a good initiation, such a good follow-up, really good for chasing people down uh, if you need to close that gap. And then you can also have your leap to get away. So good. I love this change that they made to him. Um, he seems really, really strong. So as you can see, there was my... Uh, I'm going to jump right here to just kind of get this slow. Really good job. Good gank. Uh, so they had a good gank too, though. Um, there is Apollo's Chariot, okay. Just wondering. Good job! Gosh, it's Athena's on top of it! I'm glad that that was our Apollo, that scared the crap out of me. Uh, but their, their Apollo was also... Oh, good. Tank it up for me. Cool, cool, cool. Um, it's just really good rotations by my team. Uh, let's go ahead and grab this, uh, this little mini camp over here, and then I'll go ahead and back uh, off that. Uh, but that's my third ability, that teleport, uh, is the newest thing that they added. Also, it doesn't arc, it doesn't hit another, uh, the same god twice, which is kind of good, especially with the teleport. Uh, it kind of makes it so that you can, uh, like, see where, it, like, it land it so that you can land on a god. Uh, so if you have, like, three minions, you know that it won't bounce back to those minions or something like that. You know that it'll only hit them once. So you can kind of predict it a little bit better. So I kind of like that change that they added. Fourth and ultimate ability is called something totem hold on let me get the name for you guys uh, i don't think i got the name of the two um fear no evil uh basically what this is is it's the same ultimate it's a huge circle ground target ability you summon a totem in the middle of the circle ground target ability uh what this will do don't don't juke me when i turn my fps goes crazy it goes cray cray you get back to the jungle. Um, I, uh, Athena should be back. We could probably gain mid lane. Uh, but anyways, that's my ultimate ability. So what it does is it pops out of the ground. Uh, it does physical damage to anybody. Um, uh, it does physical damage to anybody in that radius. It kind of just takes it. Uh, and then it fears anybody in the radius when it pops up. But also if they enter the radius, it will fear them again. This CC is huge. It's so good. Uh, really good initiation and kind of a zoning tool as well because if they enter that they will get feared uh, it's so good so good I've been watching uh, a lot of Hunbats uh, people playing this Athena is making uh, basically just like sitting by the buff while I destroy it um, so that we can let's gank these guys first uh, but basically uh, you if you have the mask which I do Get this mother! Get her! Ah! You get her? Yeah, good job. There's nice Hoonbats. I don't have too much health. Need to be a little bit careful. Ah, I just got owned. <laughs> 
<laughs> I tried to hit him with my three to see if the bounce would get the monkey. Uh, it didn't quite happen. Oh, here are some good engage. Holy cow. I mean, some good uh, rotations by the enemy team. They're coming in hot. That was a really good pick off. We should have just kind of taken that and ran away. Uh, I should have backed off. I don't know why. That was a pretty much a misplay by me. Um, Alright, let's go ahead and get... Devourers was my help. Void Blade will be really, really good. Especially for that Apollo and the uh, other Hoonbats. Hun I think I keep saying Sunbats. Uh, that is not the correct thing to say. It is not the correct name. And this Raw is just sitting in left lane. Uh, which isn't really necessarily helping them out. I mean, we have more kills than them. Um, so we're... But he's gonna get a tower, so... So maybe it is worth his while. Hmm. Hmm. I can probably get this guy. Heal him. I can kill him. I can't get to him fast enough, yeah. Even if I had leaped there, um... I don't think I would have gotten to him fast enough, really. Oh, uh, but that, the the AoE last slam is so good for clearing. Uh, same with Naja, uh, kind of has that same effect, um, so to speak. Did that just get killed by minions? Why is my Athena not defending this? Oh, uh, that's okay. My Athena's doing work this game, so I'm not even mad about that. Uh, we pretty much have more gold than them still, I believe. Yeah, we do. We have 2k more gold. Um, we lost one tower, and they don't have any towers lost. So that's a really good lead uh, that we have. Unfortunately, our mid keeps getting ganked. That teleport's so good! Oh my gosh, that just got me the kill right there. Uh, so like I was saying, really good for chasing people down. So good! And that, that red buff was such a good bait. I'm not even mad that they took it from me, because... That is definitely worth two kills, in my book. <laughs> definitely worth me a double kill. Um, let's see, what do we have going on? Ooh, look how fat I am! Oh, that's OP! Uh, maybe a little bit. I've seen a lot of people uh, working him really, really well. Um, did I finish all of his abilities? I did. I did finish all of his abilities. I did, I did, I did. So that teleport, oh my gosh, it's so good. And then I had a leap if I got like in a sticky situation. Oh my gosh, I still have my leap off cooldown. And I think they improved the leap, uh, and by that I mean I think they, uh, I think they increase or decrease the time that it takes for you to land. Uh, so you kind of like go up in the air and land faster. Uh, I don't really have any buffs. I have a medium camp over here. There we go. Got me a movement speed buff. Just kind of running around. Getting my buffs as much as I can. I also like that the third hit and the, the fourth hit. The fourth hit does a lot of damage, but it's really, really quick after the third hit, which is what I like. Um, however, the first two hits, I think, are kind of slow a little bit. Um, but if, if they're going to have the last two hits do the more, most damage and be, like, really quick in succession, um, then I'm not, not too mad about that at all. There's a free kill. Yeah, there's three of them. Teleported over to him. That was a really good heal. I can't see anything! No, please! There we go. Did you hear me spamming? How did our team get cleaned? That Apollo's coming for me. Oh, he didn't have enough. I don't know. Woo, baby girl! We got cleaned. I have no idea who just did that. Who cleaned us? Who's fed? Possibly their Poseidon? But he was chasing me. So I don't know who got who killed my entire team. Apollo was chasing me, Poseidon was chasing me. Did Ra do that? Did Ra just do that? No, he has no kills. I guess Hoonbats did. Hoonbats! Hoonbats! He's got really, really good AoE. I mean Sun Wukong had really, really good AoE, so obviously he does as well. 
he does as well. His second ability is so much burst damage, you can hit multiple people with it. Such a good last hit. Probably get a, uh, I'm not sure if Raw was over here or not. Raw! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> if that, like, blew your eardrums out or something. Oops. I threw it right in between those minions. That was the hardest skill shot I've ever aimed for. And, and successfully hit right between those minions. I really don't want to fight them again in this area. Be careful. But it looks like we might get an engagement. So I'm going to grab this as fast as possible and then head back over. So it looks like we're about to... We're about to throw down! Oh, this is gonna hurt so bad. Yeah, I was pretty much dead there. Golly, my team's getting stomped. My Isis and uh, my Isis and Apollo are getting crushed, or at least my Isis is. My Apollo's not really just doing that much, to be honest. <laughs> Woo! I gotta carry this game so hard. No, don't do it! Don't surrender, please! I I think I just gotta get in a good position, and I think I can. I just need to pick people because I went in too hard there. Um, I, I beelined for that, uh, that Hoonbats, uh, when I saw him. Oh, come on. Come on, alright. Like a favorite if you enjoy, hex subscribe, why not? This is Wither Spoon signing off. Peace out, guys.